I got in one of the first orders of the Starlink Mini and we're gonna open it up and check it out. Here's the box. You can see it's not very big. I can pick it up with one hand. I can open it with one hand. There's the instructions. Open it up. Turn on the app. Oh, plug it in. <laughs> so this one has the Wi-Fi router built into it. My Starlink, I have the regular Starlink, has a separate Wi-Fi. So it looks like it comes with a nice amount of cord. Nice cord. These keep the water out when you plug it in. So that pops up. That's the stand. Put that through here. There's the ethernet port. We're not gonna be using the ethernet. There we go. This is used if you're gonna mount it on a pole. I'm not gonna mount this one on a pole. We're just gonna set it up right here, see if it works. Let's plug it in. First step after plugging it in was to add the dish to the app and give it a password, then download the update. Next, we had to orientate it. It was really easy to do. It told me to turn it 23 degrees. It gave me a picture on how to turn it. I turned it and it instantly showed it being turned until I got it to the right direction. Then we did a speed test. Here's the initial test. Here's the test right after the initial test, which got us some pretty good speeds. Here's the advanced speed test. And it does not like to be behind walls. I don't see this being effective at home where the Wi-Fi is in the dish, which is outside, and I'm inside the house. I'll find out this weekend how effective it'll be inside a camp trailer. Crossing my fingers, I'll report back to you.